Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Serena. So today I have another Amazon favorites video for you. This will be my fifth Amazon video. So if you guys have missed or not seen my other Amazon videos, I will link them at the end of this video. I have an Amazon playlist. So this is my fifth video. I do these videos pretty often. I'm a very avid Amazon shopper and I know you guys are too because you guys really seem to love these videos. So I've combed through my Amazon purchase history recently and I've picked picked five or six things that I think are good enough to share with you guys, things that I found myself really liking. So we're going to jump into that video in a bit, but first, if you guys are new here, welcome. My name is Serena and I have a lifestyle channel here on YouTube. I would love to have you as a subscriber, so don't leave without clicking that subscribe button down below. Now, without further ado, let's get into the video, shall we? So I scooted over here so you guys can see the stock photos. I like to insert stock photos of the items that I'm showing you guys just because I like to see what it looks like on Amazon versus real life. This is actually the first item. This is going to be honest to goodness, kind of like a basic B Amazon purchases video because a lot of these are very popular items. I usually like to show like the odd oddball weird items, but I've got a lot of basic B items in this video to be honest. But some of these are basic B very popular items because they're just that good. You know what I mean? So I, I advocate, I stand for them. So this is the Dynamic SE 30 ounce double walled tumbler. So 30 ounces, a lot of liquid can fit in this. This is a double walled tumbler, so it's gonna keep your drinks really cold. I just tend to use it only for water. I shove a bunch of ice in there, top it off with water, and it stays really cold for a really long time. I personally, if I'm being completely honest, like are the Yetis better? Yeah, the Yetis are technically better. They're gonna keep your stuff a lot colder for a lot longer, but this works perfectly for me. I'll fill it with ice, you know, go to bed at night. And then in, you know, the middle of night, I take a sip. It's still really cold. It's perfect. That's like what I need. And it will stay cold and still have ice in it all the way till the morning. So for me, you can't beat that for $15.99. I paid $15.99 for this. The price raised to $16.99 since I bought it. But I feel like Amazon fluctuates like that. They're kind of sneaky with their prices. It does come in 14 colors. So there's a lot of different colors. The green came really nicely. There was no, um, there was no inconsistency inconsistencies in like the wrap of the color of the mug. There was some inconsistencies in the photos and the reviews saying that like the leopard print one was kind of funky. Like there was like one review I saw that somebody was complaining about that. So be aware if you're, you know, the leopard print one catches your eye, just make sure you really read through the reviews. Speaking of the reviews, there's 152 reviews and this has a four and a half out of five star ranking. So it's really good. Um, it comes with two metal straws, so a little bendy guy, and it comes with a straight guy, and then it comes with the straw cleaner. I'm very partial to glass straws because I like to see inside of my straw and make sure that I got it clean enough. The straw cleaner works with the glass straws. So this actually originally comes with, you see there's like a snap on right here that you can lift up for if you're drinking just like out of it like a mug without a straw. And it comes with a like rubber plug that's in there that holds the skinny metal straws in place. However, I just pulled the plug out and just kind of tucked it away somewhere because I wanted to be able to fit my giant glass straws in here. I will link these glass straws down below if you're kind of a germaphobe like I am, like, or just, you just wanna make sure your straw is clean. I don't think that's a germaphobe thing. You know what I mean? Um, I'll link these straws below because I also got these on Amazon. But I really like this mug and I think that it's a good value you. And this is a 30 ounce, so it really is just going to last you throughout the day. And I personally feel like this really encourages me to drink water, which is really good to stay hydrated. So that is our first item of the day. Okay, next item is kind of a fun one. These are pajama pants. And I really like them. They're like kind of like just fun, cheapy pajama pants. And I just think they're great. So these are what they look like, just kind of like next to me on camera. I don't know if you can kind of tell what material these are. It's like silky, they're really comfortable. And the waistband is like really high waisted, which I like, and you can roll the waistband down, which I like. They're really sheer and they're really long. So they're just like a wide leg. I'll insert a photo here, the stock photo on Amazon of what these look like. They're popular for a reason, I really like them. They're inexpensive, they're $15.99, that's what I paid. The sizing that I got is size extra large and it comes in 15 colors. So if the floral print 
is not your thing and you kind of wanted to poke around and see what else they had. But they have a lot of colors. They're just really cute lounge pants. I really like them. There's 2,288 reviews at the time that I kind of checked this out. These have a four and a half out of five star rating. So if you guys are interested in some cute, cozy lounge pants under 20 bucks, I feel like these can't be beat. It's really funny. My sister-in-law and I both got these at the same time and like neither of us told the other one and then one day she just showed up and I was wearing mine and she was wearing hers and I was just like, great minds think alike. So if you guys want to check these out, check out the link in the description box below. Okay, so I have a funky donkey one for you. I forgot, I do have a funky item here. This is a black light. It's a black light. So this is the Tautronics black light. It actually comes with a pair of glasses. I'll insert a clip for you right here of the stock photo. So I got this black light for a number of reasons. Okay, I'm sure you guys can guess. You guys can guess, right? So this was $15.99 when I bought it. The price went up to $16.99. This has 2,533 reviews, four and a half out of five stars. I use this for three different things. One, I use it for cleaning my bathroom. I know that sounds really dramatic. I swear to you guys, I am not a big germaphobe. Like I'm pretty laid back. But when it comes to cleaning the bathroom, I'm just really adamant about like, I mean, you guys have husbands boyfriends, sons, just turn it on and then you'll be scarred for life and you'll be taking a Clorox wipe all over like just everything. So I mean splatter, you guys, I know it's gross, but I'm not the only one who uses a black light to clean their bathroom, okay? Look at the reviews and you'll see I'm not crazy. Second thing I use is for, I have pets and I like to be able to check if there's any piddle stains on the carpet. My big dog, my shepherd, ugh, obviously she doesn't go to the bathroom in house. She's completely house trained. But my little tiny toy poodle, if she doesn't make it in time, she's kind of an older dog. So if she doesn't make it in time or, you know, she sneaks away, I can find little little piddle stains on the carpet. I know it's gross again, but you have to be able to see the stains to clean them. You know what I mean? And the third and final thing that I use this for is finding tomato hornworms in my garden on my tomatoes and my peppers. I am a bit of a vegetable gardener right now. I'm trying my hand at gardening and growing heirloom organically grown fruits and stuff or fruits and vegetables that my husband and I can eat. And there's a thing called a tomato horn room. I will insert a photo for your viewing pleasure. Yeah. Yeah, that's a tomato hornworm. They're kind of pretty from afar, but up close they're really nasty. They're disgusting and they will annihilate your pepper plants and your tomato plants. And it's a moth that comes in and lays her eggs on your leaves and then the eggs hatch and then these monstrous tomato hornworms grow like crazy and they will obliterate your plants. I had um, some peppers growing and I was so excited. It's like earlier in the season I looked, I was like, oh my gosh, I have peppers growing and they were like forming and they were big. The next day I went out and they were completely gone, like not a trace, just the stump of a stem was left. And I was like, what the heck? So I did my research, I found out it was tomato hornworms and I found out that if you go out at nighttime in the pitch black and you shine a black light on your tomato plants and your peppers, the tomato hornworms will glow under the black light. So you're able to grab them and some people throw them away. I save them and I give them to my chickens to murder in the morning just to be like really ruthless. But yeah, that's, it's such a weird thing to do, but that's, that's what I do. I go out at night and I hunt for tomato hornworms on my pepper and tomato plants because I'm a crazy garden lady and I'm not, I'm not ashamed. I'm not ashamed. So anyways, if you guys um, want to use this for any of those things, it's worth the money to be honest. The other thing, if you live in the desert, scorpions. I don't live in the desert. I mean, I live in a desert. I live in California, but in California where I live, scorpions aren't a problem. But if you live in like Las Vegas or you live in like a really deserty area, scorpions can like crawl into your shoes and all kinds of stuff, but they glow under a black light. And if you don't believe me, ask the dishes or look at the Amazon reviews because they, you see in the photos of the Amazon reviews, all of these scorpions that are like obviously poisonous and could totally sting you. So uh, black light is a surprisingly handy thing to have. So now that I've talked for, you know, six minutes about a black light, let's move on to the next item. Okay, so the next two items are sports bras. 
And first up we have the Coastal Rose Zip Front Sports Bra. So this is what it looks like. It's got a zipper in the front and the back is this really cool crisscrossy detail. It's just a simple black sports bra. It's got a moderately thick like liner that is removable. You can pull these out if you don't want them. There's no hook and eye at the top, but it just zips all the way down. And then there's this little area here that has a flap that kind of keeps it from coming undone. I bought a size large, I think. Yes, I got a size large. I'll insert a clip for you guys right here of what it looks like on Amazon, like the stock photos. This is $23.99 and it has 49 reviews and four and a half out of five star rating. I actually really like this. This is just a really comfortable, very soft bra. It's not gonna be good for crazy high impact. My size, if you're curious about my cup size, my bust size, I thought I was a 36D for the longest time but apparently I got I got remeasured and I'm a 34 triple D so that could be why a lot of bras weren't fitting me right but now that I know my measurement I'm kind of able to buy you know a little bit more intelligently the large fits me fine it's a little low cut which I like I, I personally like the scoop neck sports bras I like there to be a little bit of cleavage and I really like the back I just really like that strappy detail I think it's just really cool I would recommend it if you're looking for just like an inexpensive sports bra that is gonna give you a little bit of support and it's just comfortable it's really comfortable and I really like the back I think it's cute it's got that like lululemon type thing going on and so does this next one here so the next sports bra let me turn my page so I can look at my notes this is the CRZ yoga top yoga cross strappy back sports bra so it's got the same strappy back details this one's a little bit more plain Definitely not a high impact sports bra again. So the back is really cute. This is one of those like, you know, I keep saying basic B, like I don't want it to sound like it's negative. It's just one of those bras that's been, or one of those items on Amazon that's been on a lot of people's Amazon favorites list because it's just a good bra. It's supposed to be like a big dupe for one of the Lululemon sports bras that are way more expensive. This was $20. So $20 compared to whatever the, the Lululemon one, usually those are like $40, $50, $60, depending upon the bra. But this one's really great. The size I got in this is large as well. This one, for my triple D Tatas, this one they're like, it's barely holding it in, you know what I mean? But again, I, I wear it for like walking the dogs. Like I wouldn't be on the treadmill wearing this, but for like lifting weights, for walking the dogs, for every day. Like if you just want a comfortable everyday bralette that's like really cool in the back, you know what I mean? And you just want that fun look under your tank tops. This is a great bra and it's a great price. The color that I got is Charcoal Heather. And this one, as far as reviews go, there's 110 reviews, four stars, and you can get it in four different colors. So that, I, I really like both of these sports bras a lot. So I would recommend those to you. And okay, so I know that in my last Amazon video, I listed hats but I got another hat on Amazon. It's just that they just have such good stuff for such a good price. And I actually really am impressed with this one just kind of overall as far as the quality and stuff. So this is the Lanzom Wide Brim Straw Panama Hat. This was $15.99, the color is brown. That's what it's listed as. It comes in like a gajillion different colors and the, the seller also has like different styles, like different band styles and stuff like that. But I just liked this one for being a basic easy going hat. Now in the description on this it says that this is like rollable like you can roll it up and put it in your suitcase I don't know about that I mean I haven't tried it but like I really wanted to keep it shaped because I really like the shape this claims to be a, a rating of UPF 50 which just means it's like sunscreen but the clothing equivalent of the SPF is UPF so like you know sunscreen is like SPF 50 this is supposedly UPF 50 which if that's true I don't always trust what they say on Amazon like like the description you guys know what I mean sometimes Amazon is just like shady O'Grady if if it does have a UPF 50, that's pretty awesome. I really like the way this looks on too. If you wanna check out some photos, I'll put a clip right here of some photos, you know, what it looks like. But um, there's a lot of reviews. There's uh, 1,700 reviews, over 1,700. Four and a half stars out of five as far as the rating goes. I like this, like I'll put it on over my headband. But like, do you know what I mean? Like, it's just kind of cute. And um, obviously like the headband's adding a little bit of extra bulk. You guys, I'm such a nerd. You're gonna be like, why is she putting this on with her headband? 
because I don't want to take the headband off. You don't want to see what I've got going on under there. But anyways, cute, right? Just like a simple hat, like wear it to the beach, that kind of thing. I just, this is my jam. And it's really comfortable like if you're gardening or whatever, or if you just want to be cash, throw some denim shorts, you know, basic v-neck white tee or something like that, or a black tee to match the band some sandals, some shades, you're good to go, and you're kind of a little bit more protected out of the sun. And if you can roll it, that's pretty awesome. I just haven't tried it because, sorry, I gotta fix my hair. Look, now I've got like a hat line. Way to go, Serena. Look at this. Anyways, I really like this hat. So I recommend it to you. It's adjustable. It's got this little strap right here that's adjustable. So if you want to tighten it for whatever reason, you can. But anyways, that is our final Amazon item of today. All right, now that I have a uh, weird hat line on my forehead that you guys may or may not be able to see in post-production, that is all my items for today's Amazon video. Don't forget to check out the playlist at the very end of this video here if you guys want to check out more items that I would recommend to you from Amazon because I've got a lot. And I've been trying to keep these videos way shorter and just only listing like five to six items because my other videos are like 40 minutes long not lying. So if you guys want to get a bucket of popcorn and kick your feet up, a glass of wine, you guys can watch those other like 40 minute long videos where I list like 5 million items. Anyways, I love you guys and I hope you guys subscribe if you're not already subscribed. Don't forget, if you guys like this video, give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends. I will see you guys in the next video. I love you so much. Bye.